The evil in this place must be rooted out. So, you were saying something earlier about your people. The Skull, I think they were called? We have lived on Solstheim for many generations. Our people are tied to the land itself. We try to serve the Allmaker, to live in balance with nature, instead of exploiting it, as others would. Huh, so I guess they are rather similar to the, uh, wildlings. But I never did ask. How come you're here all by yourself? There are few of us left unaffected by this curse. My father Storm, the shaman, protects them in the village. I fashioned an amulet to guard me against whatever has taken hold of the skull, but it is the only one of its kind. If I cannot find a way to save them, there is no hope for our people. Okay, that makes sense. Because before I wasn't sure how everyone else was getting affected, yet she remained somewhat normal. We must find out what is at work here. Well, let's get moving then. Find them. Oh, I thought that was the tip of their mask. You won't win. Where'd you come from? I am sorry, but you left me with no choice. Okay, hearing that is actually pretty damn interesting. Because what she told us earlier made it sound like maybe she wasn't a huge fan of harming the animals, or at least not without actually needing, you know, their meat, hide, and everything else they carry. But now it seems like maybe she doesn't care too much for killing people either. And even ones like these. Which is awfully strange, because if you look at her, she seems a bit like a warrior, to be honest. Just kind of going off the armor and even the axe at her side. But who knows, maybe I'm digging a bit too deep into we must be careful in these ruins. that line Traps of dialogue. Can be anywhere, and there will likely be many. Mirak was trying to take power here. Yeah, and then what happened to him? Is it really that he's dead and all those slaves or people under the influence are trying to resurrect him? Or is there something else I'm not seeing? I do not wish to imagine the kinds of things that happened in this chamber. Who are the poor souls trapped in these cages? What tortures did they suffer at Mirak's hands? Was it in service to the dragons? Or for his own purposes? You know, judging by everything we've heard so far... Look up there. I think I see something. I'd say he did this to serve his own needs. The stairs are knocked out. I have no doubt you can find a way up. You never know. You may find something of value up there. I shall look around. We can proceed when you are ready. Yeah, I guess we'll meet back up with you in a bit. I gotta imagine we can just jump up here, though. I mean, that doesn't seem too high, does it? Um... Impressive. See, there we go. Was it worth the effort? I'm not too sure yet. Okay, it was definitely worth the effort. No doubt about that. So I gotta wonder, is this bow better than ours, or not? Alright, so they're both 39, however, the one in here still has a charge. 
So maybe we ought to use that for now. Especially given that we don't have any of those special arrows that Arbo is meant to be using. But here's some of that new armor. So I'm also wondering if maybe that's better than the stuff we have now. Okay, it definitely isn't. So that should be all. And really quickly, let's go ahead and hotkey this. Just in case we need to use it. Although, the place looks relatively clear for now. Oh, never mind. Who's there? I knew I heard something. Oh, look at that. Even the bodies in the cages are waking up. What was that? Oh yeah, I knew it sounded like they were all over the place. Looks like they were right beneath us. Alright, just one more to go. Pretty sure they can handle them though. Now I will say, by the end of this, I would love to have maybe some new armor, but most definitely a new weapon. Because as much as I love the iron ones, this just isn't cutting it as of now. And we should probably just try to upgrade our smithing, just so we can raise the damage, but I think we have a long ways to go to make it so that's any good you know what I wish they would have done though was made something similar to how the witcher did it where sometimes you run into a blacksmith that's actually really good at increasing the level of weapons or just has much better ones for sale Something's not right here. Be careful. I think we may be in for some trouble. But who knows, maybe they'll try that Who's for the there? next Elder Scrolls. But as of now, pretty much the entire map just seems to sell the same basic thing. Which isn't terrible, it just makes some of the uh, locations you discover later on a bit less unique, I guess you could say. What was it? Yeah, I'm noticing already these Draugr are quite a bit tougher than anything we've fought before. Aside from some of the bigger stuff like dragons or giants and I think back in that other room with all the cages there was a Draugr death lord and as crazy as it sounds that was the first one of them that we had ever seen and I think they're actually some of the toughest you can find What's that? 
Now we end it. Okay, that is not what I wanted that to do. I guess that works, though. I thank you for your protection. Who's there? And there's our potion. Again. Okay, hopefully not too much further. Oh, check that out. Some Nordic arrows. Hopefully at this point we'll be finding a lot more of them. Okay, I think I have an idea. Hold! <laughs> I'm not going down there. It would be foolish to attempt it. You have a much better chance than I to make it through these traps. I have no doubt that lever turns these blades off. I shall wait here for now. Uh, I was afraid she'd say that. Oh no. Serana, get the hell out of here. Okay, that should do for now. Thank you. Mirak took great pains to make it difficult to reach him, it seems. Let us hope that is the last of these traps. Yeah, seriously. I kind of doubt that's going to be the case, though, to be honest. Hmm. Well, that's a first. The evil in this place must be rooted out. Yeah, I was gonna say, whatever this is, it does not look good. Luckily, they haven't seen us yet. I guess that wasn't so bad though, was it? I do not know what it is Mirak learned that gave him reason to turn on his masters. But his path seems to have been a cruel one. 
Is someone there? Where'd you go? I am sorry, but you left me with no choice. See, there she goes again. So it must just be any living thing. Who's there? I'm guessing that's just the way of her clan, you though. And so it ends. Interesting. This may be worth exploring. Well, I think this may be her only way. Oh. So you're just gonna run all the way down there then, huh? Well, hang on. Because I feel like there might be. I suspected there would be something down here. Do you know those spells? Already? Okay, you know what? Maybe she has a point. So there's Mage Light. Pretty sure we already have that one. The Soul Trap. But I guess we could always sell it too. Oh, and this even goes deeper. Or I guess just back to where we were before. Find them. Where'd you come from? And that should do it. I will say at this point, I do kind of wish that maybe Mirak had some other worshippers as well, aside from these cultists. So that way we could fight the mage style ones that we're seeing right now, along with maybe some ones that have shields or heavy armor. I think that would have been a cool way to mix it up. But who knows, maybe we'll see him later on down the road. Was there another way around here, though? Ah! Oh yeah, this ought to work. How much deeper can this be? I had been told that Mirak's power was great, but to have built so large a temple, Stay on your it cannot be much farther now. I feel it in my bones. Yeah, judging by this thing, I'd say you must be right. I had heard Mirak had turned against the dragon cult, but to display the remains in such a manner as this. Something feels wrong. Brace yourself. Oh no. Who's there? I knew I had something. Looks like everything's coming down on us. Okay, that is not good.
Ah, here it is. And I think we may need to try hotkeying it. The evil in this place must be rooted out. Because it looks like it got rid of that, too. Oh, so these guys carry ebony weapons? I'm sure those will come in handy. And this must be the door that that key opens up. Okay, seems like they're dead. Lucky for us. The evil in this place must be rooted out. I'm with you on that one. Although I think we can all agree that's a bit easier said than done. Dead end? Impossible. There must be something more. Look around. I will let you know if I find anything in the dining area. Yeah, same here. We do have that key, so maybe there's one more thing that that'll open up. Or there's always this. I knew it. A secret passage in the dining area just opened up. This must be it. Let us move quickly. Oh yeah, right over there. Very neat. So what, is this our way down or should we go through here first? Must be this way. I wonder if there is something here that tells the story of Mirak. You know, I was about to say the same thing. Nothing but ruined books. Yeah, unfortunately. Hopefully we'll eventually learn a bit more about him, I do him, not though. recognize this statuary. We passed by a few of them earlier, but... They are becoming more frequent as we get further in. Hmm. I do not like this place. It almost looks as if these statues will come to life at any moment. You think so? It is eerily quiet. I do not suspect that will be the case the further we go. Be on your guard. Oh, wow. This is a little creepy. Oh yeah. This has got bad news written all over it. 